teaching you guys how I myself blew up on Pinterest. Like all the tips and tricks that worked for me. I'm not saying this is what you have to do, but this will work for me in like a fast period of time. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and let's get into this video. All right, guys. So if you go check my Pinterest account, like right now, I have over like 400K monthly views and also a total of 1.3 million impressions, like overall on Pinterest. Now, I will say when it comes to the first thing that helped me out for growing my Pinterest account, it was making sure I niched and also found a target audience. So I made sure that I niched down to what I wanted to do and made sure that I created content for a certain audience. That way I found people that were interested that I was into. So pretty much my whole Pinterest account is based off clothing. I post outfit and spo when it comes to like men, women, mainly women, because I noticed that Pinterest, like I have way more women followers and like way more women interacting than men. So way more women clothing stuff, but like I still do both. And mainly I focus on black people as well. Like black men clothing black women clothing like stuff like that and i just made sure that i found a niche and target audience like obviously my niche is clothing i'm targeting people that are inspired by the clothing that i post and like i made sure that i stuck with it like, next thing i will say when it came to growing my pinterest account was i made sure that i created content that was already going viral so I had a pin that went viral out of nowhere. It was called Gray Flannel Outfits. I put three pictures in there with three different people, including myself, and it went viral. It was my best Pinterest like pin out of all of them at the time. It went viral. It had over like 200K impressions by itself. It's reached way more like now. It's way past that, but like I noticed it blew up. And I was like, okay, time to create content that's similar to this. That way it blows up more. And that definitely worked. When I tell y'all I created content like that, I made sure I did the same steps I did in my last post, which was like finding keywords, finding good pictures, and it blew up. Like any ones that were similar to that, they blew up just like that, or probably even past it. Make sure you like really, really, really post content similar to stuff that already went viral because it's gonna more than likely blow up as well. Another thing I will say is promotion. Like a lot of people do not like promote their Pinterest accounts a lot. I noticed that like Pinterest is not like a big, 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 big like platform. Like even though you can almost find anything up there, like it's really not like talked about enough. It's really underrated. Like, so I recommend like promoting your Pinterest account like on all accounts. Like I promote my Pinterest on Instagram and Snapchat. That's all though. Cause like I make sure I'm promoting the people that will actually interact. Like, also like send it out to anybody I know. Like if I know somebody that has a Pinterest account, I send it out to them and make sure they follow, you know, interact your friends. Like just make sure you promote. Like there's never nothing wrong with promoting all your stuff on your pages. Like you can never not promote enough but the next thing i will say is research and advice like when i first got on pinterest i never knew nothing about it all my friends beforehand knew about pinterest like had it for years probably months and like i had just got it and yet i surpassed like all of them on pinterest when it came to me like posting my stuff and content they don't really use it for what i use it for so i'm not gonna make it like oh i'm just better than them but like I pretty much got to a way bigger point than they did on the app by doing my own steps. They did their own thing, I did my own. I made sure I researched and I asked for advice. When I got on Pinterest, I asked them about pins, how to create pins, what to do, like all that. They gave me advice. And then I also went on my own, did my own research. Like I found keywords. I found this thing called rapid tags. I think I know about it. We use it for YouTube. I pretty much like used that and like for my keywords and like I incorporated them into my pins. Like, all of my pants have like a lot of random words in it that way like it gets more traffic i guess like if people look up black men outfits and i have that as one of the keywords and it's going to come up like that's why i recommend doing your own research and advice and finding your own steps and ways too like how i'm telling y'all now my next thing is collabing make sure like you'll notice yourself as well when you start to grow on pinterest you'll get collab offers like to different boards these boards can be very random like very random guys from like flowers all the way up to like clothing make sure you always accept though never like just leave it sitting there or like don't accept it decline it no always accept because in the day your pins are going up like you want yourself to go up and that's giving you a way wider range of like people um, in general that you can pull into your account make sure you accept any type of collab offers you get when it comes to pinterest i have said it all mine like come up in your notification bar like you've been invited to this board and always accept it this came to a point where pinterest like sent me an email to like review this new app that hasn't came out yet that they're working on and like really does all pay off like just don't never be too hollywood to not accept the like collab boards you feel like they're too lame or like not good enough like no always accept all of them any way they can grow your account always accept it like never decline it at all 
Now, I wrote down on this notebook, like, my in the last 30 days, how much my Pinterest has done. Now, guys, I no longer post very consistently on Pinterest. Like, it's been a while since I posted. But my analytics and stuff are still very good. This is my stuff in the last 30 days. I have got 449.4K impressions, 37.5K engagements, and 240.4K total audience. And all together, my total impressions are still at 1.3 million. They went up a little bit, but like it's hard to pass a number like that. My engaged audience is 14.6K only because I have been posting consistently. I promise y'all when you post pins and like any of that, like back to back, like you see it blow up, you want it just like that. I promise y'all them inlets will boost up. My stuff went up very easily. Like monthly views went up very easily from like zero to 100K in like a month of using Pinterest. So like literally guys, I hope these work for y'all. Thank y'all for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video.